we are looking at rates using the examples of gym membership. A rate is a comparison of an amount per unit. So casual visitors to the gym are charged $10 per visit, amount per unit. Gym membership cost per week. Going to the gym three times a week is a rate. So it's often in time, weeks, or per visit. And we do need to be able to do some maths with rates. So here's our example. Ryle's two-month gym membership costs him sorry, $182, and casual visitors charge $10 per visit. How much does gym membership cost per week? Now, when I've got a monthly uh, amount, to get to a weekly amount, because there's different numbers of days and weeks in each month, we've actually got to go up to a year and then divide by 52 to get the amount per week. So you have a couple of options. But easiest is to say two months is 182. How many lots of two months are there in a year? There's six lots of two months because I've got to get up to 12 months. So the annual cost is six times 182. So that's 10,000, sorry, my numbers today are very bad. $1,092 per year. And then the weekly cost is the annual amount divided by 52. And you've already got that in your calculator, so divide by 52. That's $21 per week. So you get it up to the annual cost and then divide by 52 to get a weekly cost. And that goes for any cost that's in months or quarters or anything like that. If you want a weekly cost, you have to get up to years first. Raoul goes to the gym three times a week. How much does he save by being a member? So the weekly cost for Raoul is $21. We need to compare that to what it would cost if he wasn't a member. So casually, it's $10 per visit. And if Raoul was still going three times a week, that would be 30. The membership cost is only $21 a week, which we worked out before. So the saving, is 30 minus 21 so he's saving nine dollars a week which is enough for you know two or three extra coffees per week so that's pretty good or if it was over the year he's saving close on five hundred dollars by being a member so that's nice how many visits to the gym does a member need to make in order to make membership worthwhile? So, oh, in, sorry, that should be in two months. So it's And the question is, how many times do I need to go to the gym to make that worthwhile to pay the membership? So, you know, if I only went once in two months, that would be $10 if it was casual or $182 if I had a membership. So obviously going once isn't worthwhile. What you'll need to do is divide the cost by what it would cost to go casually to see how many times that could pay for you to go casually. So 
So that says that $182 would pay for 18 and a bit casual visits. So it's only worth getting a membership if you're going to go more times than this. So the next whole number up is 19. Now we also have to look at heart rate with the gym because of course heart rate is a rate beats in seconds and my pulse this morning was 20 beats in 15 seconds. We normally take the pulse over 15 or 20 seconds or you ask your Fitbit these days and then we change it to beats per minute BPM and the formula for finding beats per minute is the number of beats divided by the time in seconds times 60 to get that to minutes. So my BPM was 20 beats divided by 15 seconds times 60 20 divided by 15 times 60, 80 beats per minute. The maximum heart rate that I should have in my age group is 150 beats per minute. And the table for this is in your textbook near the question. Ideally, exercising heart rate is 60% of the maximum. What's my ideal exercising heart rate? We know how to deal with percentages now. I want to find 60% of 150 beats per minute. We write 60% over 100 as a fraction of becomes times, and that's 150. 60 over 100 times 150. My ideal exercising heart rate is 90 beats per minute. So if I go over that, I'm exercising too hard for my health and I should probably back off a bit.